What's up guys, I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media bringing you some Dragon Ball Legends breaking news. So what you see on your screen over here, or, or maybe over here, I don't really know, it's somewhere on the screen, is the latest Dragon Ball Legends V-Jump scan that just dropped this morning, and your eyes do not deceive you. Perfect Cell and Instant Transmission Kamehameha Super Saiyan Goku are on their way to the game and they're set to launch sometime in early September or possibly mid-September. But either way, this is very very exciting news because I know a lot of people were waiting anxiously for a sparking Perfect Cell to be in Legends and now it's finally officially confirmed so I'm very happy for all you Perfect Cell or just Cell fans in general out there. And the other exciting part of this news release is that Super Saiyan Teen Gohan is probably coming with them. Now I know, there's nothing on the actual release that has anything to do with Gohan, they don't mention him at all, and they also don't show an image of him. But I truly believe that they're just holding on to that information so that would be more exciting when it's announced in game or when the actual banner drops. So you guys who were hoping for a Gohan and sell, you know, kind of dual release, don't worry, I think it will still happen. They're just you know, they're just trying to be sneaky about it. Anyways, um, I'm gonna look over here because I have no idea how to read Japanese. So I have some translation over here that were done by people in the Dragon Ball Legends subreddit. So big shout out to those guys. Thank you so much for making this video possible because otherwise it would just be a picture and I have, would have no idea what it says. But here we go. Let's just jump right into it, starting with Cell. Cell's super is Super Kamehameha. He's a strike offensive unit. He has a unique ability against Saiyans, and he also has the Android tag. As for Goku, he has Instant Transmission Kamehameha, which is what I referred to before, and he also appears to be a Blast-based unit. His main ability uh, can counter against Cover Charge, and or sorry, Cover Change. He counters against Cover Change. What's Cover Charge? I don't know. Um, and his Instant Transmission Kamehameha will probably be some kind of Actually, this is probably more just speculation at this point because I don't think that's what it says on the actual scan. But I believe it's going to be some kind of Vanish plus Super combo. There's some people that are speculating that it's just going to be straight up unavoidable. It's just going to be an unavoidable Super. But I think that's way too OP. Just being a Vanish plus Super alone is already pretty strong, so I'm already happy with that. So I think they're probably going to go that route. If they do make it unavoidable, sure, they're just going to make him a little bit OP and uh, people are going to be upset. Or some people who don't pull him at least are going to be upset. But either way, let's go to the stat distribution now. And uh, the stats are on the right side of the page. And it's supposedly HP at the top and then going clockwise, strike damage is next followed by blast damage, defense, and key regen. And I don't know if this is accurate, I'm just going based off of what people told me in the subreddit. Um, but if that's accurate, then it looks like Cell will be a bit of a glass cannon. He will have high strike and blast damage, but low HP, low defense, and low key regen. While for Goku, he will have very high blast damage, low strike damage. And, uh, but overall, he'll be more balanced. He'll have more of a balance in the other criteria as well. So it looks like Cell's more like damage output, and then Goku's more balanced with more of a blast damage focus. But yeah, that's pretty much gonna do it for the video. This is all the information I have on these units at this point. Like I said, they're set to launch early to mid-September, so we'll probably hear more about them as we get closer to that launch date. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of these upcoming units. Are you excited for the new Cell? Are you excited for the new Super Saiyan Goku? And are you excited about a potential Teen Gohan as well? I also want to hear if any of you are upset about the fact that we're getting yet another Super Saiyan Goku, even though we already have a couple of them in the game. Even though this one does seem to do things a little bit differently based off what we see here and also just our speculations, so I guess only time will tell. Anyways, that's all for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you liked the video, make sure to like the damn video, and if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, and you want to see more of it, then maybe just maybe hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. As always, hope you guys have a fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.